little draws here and I have another video for you. We're doing a challenge video today and the challenge we're gonna be doing is the three color challenge. So today I'm gonna take that part and on top of being only able to choose three colors blindly, so I have no idea what colors I'm choosing, so the colors might be completely different. It's gonna be a challenge, definitely. On top of that, I'm using pen. So pen does not blend together very nicely. Like, you have to use different colors of that color, like different shades of that color to make it actually look somewhat blended. So this is gonna be difficult. So, But now I have done my research, research on YouTube. And I have pre-drawn a picture. I have lined it. And it's just an anim a simple anime girl because I think that'll be simpler and easier to do. So I did a simple anime girl. So I'm going to blindly choose three colors and I am hoping and praying that they actually like will blend. I'm going to close my eyes now. <laughs> okay, my eyes are closed. I have no idea what colors I'm choosing. I hope I choose some good colors. Uh, don't like I hope I don't choose like a brown or something. Okay, so here's my first color I didn't I didn't look at it yet. I'm gonna look at all of them at the end Okay, so this is my third color of the third, second color. And here's my third color. So I did not look. I had my eyes closed the entire time, I swear. So let's see what colors I got. Oh my. I swear, I did not look during the entire thing. And this is perfect. Whoa. This is perfect. All these colors blend will blend so nicely with each other. Wow, okay, I got lucky. But the one thing is, um, I don't know how I'm supposed to shade her body with these colors. I'll see if I can do pink. But, so yeah, let's get started with that. So, here goes nothing. So, for the shading, this is gonna be a pretty much, um, no, not sped up or anything. I'm just gonna go straight. And for the shading, I think I'm gonna use the pink. So, so. <laughs> There goes, oh gosh, that's my shadow right there. Let me see, turn off my lamp. Oh yeah, that's a bit better lighting. Okay, let's go. Wow, that's bright pink. <laughs> so let me just do a little, <laughs> wow, it's like bright pink. Okay. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. So I'm gonna start by shading her body. It's already looking really weird, but. Oh geez. Wow. This is gonna look very interesting. <laughs> this looks so weird. Wow. Uh. I'm just right now shading her face and body a little bit. <laughs> oh, jeez. Shading is going on so far. That's what's happening. She looks like she has pink skin. <laughs> this looks so weird. 
cats. I mean, those are the colors I chose and I knew it was gonna be a challenge, so. <laughs> so there's gonna be minimal to no editing in this video. Probably just gonna be like some music in the background or something so it's not as awkward. Because right now, while I'm filming this, it's very awkward because it's just quiet, just silence while I am <laughs> doing this. Uh, okay. Wow, this is looking so strange. So incredibly strange. Oh, why me? So incredibly strange. Okay, so now I'm just gonna shade her legs. So these actually are very um, nice. They very, they blend together nicely. But they work good. But they're not bad pens. They're actually pretty good pens. <sighs> these are not like artist quality pens. These are like freaking school pens. So, so... <sighs> oh wow, looking very definitely very interesting. I'm kind of happy I chose pink. Like one of the colors I chose was pink though, because. That means I can, um, like do blush and everything, cause I do want her to have like some blush. So I'm just gonna like, there we go. So that's her body shaded. So that's not the end of the pink, but that's her body shaded. <laughs> okay, so I'm trying to do the hair now. Should I make her hair purple? I think we're gonna make her hair purple. I'll do the hair last. So let me do the eyes now. So I think I'm gonna do pink eyes just because these two, or should I do purple? Either, like this color will really blend with either one of them, really. So I think I'm gonna try to do purple. So let's see how that will turn out. Oh wow. So now, go in with this color. I actually like the way those two blend. They actually look pretty nice together. Okay, so those are her eyes. Wow. Definitely turning out interesting. So I think I'm gonna make her pants this color. Okay, so I'm just gonna. Oof, <laughs> that's all I can say to this. Oof. Oof, I'm so sorry, little anime girl, I'm so sorry. What have I brought upon you? What have I done to you? We're so cute. I don't know what I did to you. Mm -hmm. Well then. That's a thing I did. Definitely going for a different approach with this. Very challenging. Wow, I never, I didn't expect it to be this challenging. Okay, so I'm gonna make her shirt a purple, like purple. See, this purple is very pigmented. This purple works with me. I kind of wish I got like a green or a blue or something, just so it would pop, 
and not make all since all the colors are very similar they do blend and they do like they do go together and they do match and it was like nice to do those eyes because they kind of blended together but the one thing is that since they're so similar the the picture has really no pop it just kind of is there and it looks it's plain and I can't do anything about that because I chose these colors completely blind there's nothing I can really do about it Another reason why I'm doing no editing is because I don't, well, minimal editing. It's just because I don't want you guys to assume that I went off camera and, like, did something to make this look good or something. No, I'm going to be completely raw and just say I splatted this down and saw how it looked. And mm. So I think I am going to go with the purple. No, because I'm now, uh, what color hair should she have? I think... I think I'm gonna go with pink hair. Yeah, I'm gonna go with pink hair, so. Okay, so I finished that part, and as you can see, it has like a little reflective shine there. Mm, what am I doing with my life? Okay, so, time to do the rest of the hair. I think I'm just gonna like color this bra strap purple. Because, why not? Add a little bit more color variation here. So I'm also gonna do like a reflective shine right like in the middle here where it bends. So now it's time to color this again. So uh, this is very difficult and I'm not talking very much cause I'm trying to be focused. So now I'm going to do some shading in the hair with this color. Okay, so the color is actually somewhat layer. That's a good thing. I don't want to rip through the paper or anything. Okay, so I'm going to like add some tips. Like This color sucks. Wow. This color like... Wow, this color is like, th this pen is very dried out and I haven't used these, you know, like, I haven't used these, like, ever, so. The fact that this that pen is, like, not working is kind of getting me angry, but, kind of frustrating me, but, I mean, nothing you can really do about it. So I'm just gonna add some shading. Now I'll just kind of go. I'm done! I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed whatever I just did. <laughs> okay, so leave a comment down below what ch other challenges I should do with art. And yeah, so... I love you guys and more videos to come. Bye guys.